It appears that Amanda Bynes will continue under professional supervision while receiving psychiatric care beyond the initial 5,150 period. The shocking situation surrounding the former child star is still being processed, as Bynes was found naked and walking the streets near downtown Los Angeles last weekend. She was taken to the hospital by a passerby and is under medical care. The normal period of psychiatric hold for 5,150 is 72 hours, but it can be extended. In Amanda's case, it seems that her hold will be extended while she receives care. According to TMZ, she will likely spend a long time receiving psychiatric care and will not be ready to return home for at least another week. However, TMZ also reported that Amanda has already begun to improve under the care of psychiatrists and doctors. It is believed that she had been living on the streets for several days before being found and taken to the hospital. Her car was towed in Long Beach, and she had apparently hitchhiked or used public transportation to travel north for a few days. On Saturday, sources said that Amanda Bynes was seen naked in the Hollywood area but was still dressed. This seems to be in line with our previous report on the case. Precious readers will remember how we covered the story of a TikTok creator who saw Amanda walking alone on the streets of Hollywood on St. Patrick's Day, which was on Friday. At some point, she hitchhiked with a stranger to Beverly Hills but quickly returned to Hollywood. That's where E.T. picks up the story. In two reports on Tuesday, the outlet cited several sources who shared details about the timeline of events in Amanda's days on the streets. This outlet also references the St. Patrick's Day outing on Friday night, with one source stating that Amanda walked into Palma's smoke shop in Los Angeles on Friday night with a friend. According to the source, Amanda seemed to be having fun and celebrating St. Patrick's Day, and there didn't seem to be any problems. However, at some point during the night, something changed. Around 1 a.m. on Saturday, people saw Amanda wandering alone on Hollywood's Main Street. A second source claimed that the scene was starting to become more disturbing when a woman tried to offer help, but Amanda asked to be held. From there, the channel's second source also referenced the Beverly Hills story. It seems that Amanda was taken to BH and then returned to Hollywood. But this source also mentions a moment when Bynes allegedly claimed that her boyfriend kicked her out of his house, leading to all of this. The situation is distressing. Amanda spent days on the streets, without a car, and accepting rides from strangers. We continue to wish the best for her and hope for her full recovery.